Now at seven, the dog accused of attacking a three year old in Elmwood Place is now in custody and its owners are facing charges. Nine on your side was the only station there when the dog was captured yesterday night. Our TJ Parker spoke with the SPCA today about what's next for that dog. The dog will be quarantined in a special area here for the next 10 days to see if it has rabies and then it's up to the court to decide what happens to it. We never want to see a child injured. President of SPCA Cincinnati Harold Dates tells Nine on Your Side his team is being careful around this pit bull. A short term view of the dog is that it's extremely aggressive and uh, Coping with the dog here, we don't want any of our caregivers uh, injured, so we have to be extremely careful. Elmwood Place police say the dog attacked a three-year-old on Poplar Street Wednesday. Its owners took the dog. Eddie Butts and Leasha Williams were in court today, charged with obstructing official business and tampering with evidence. If you look at the situation and what transpired, it seems to me it's very irresponsible on the owner's part. Uh, to leave an injured child at the scene, uh, put the dog in a car and take off. The three-year-old was taken to Children's Hospital for their injuries. Dates says they will do an evaluation on the dog to figure out why this happened. The breed of dog involved is much maligned, but one has to consider the training and the behavior that was fostered by the owners of the dog. The SPCA and Elmwood police are still investigating. In Northside, I'm TJ Parker, 9 on your side. At last check, the injured three-year-old was in stable condition.